Hey everyone, it's your girl Twin D and thank you so much for stopping by my channel. Today we'll be doing as usual, checking up on our dear dear sweet masculines to see what's going on with them and just to see what state of mind they're in or just to see what they have on their mind. So let's jump right in. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. That will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For then is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Okay, let's begin and find out about their energy. Let's see what energy these masculines are in. Have adjacent possibilities and this is a number six so they are thinking about the different possibilities that they can have with their divine feminine thinking about their past love their past life all the things that they have experienced with the feminine and their heart is opening up towards this connection I just heard I'm coming. <laughs> so some masculines may be thinking about coming towards their female very soon. They're feminine, no female. <laughs> they're man holding a coin. So they're definitely going to come back to add value to your life. And they're also finding the value that you have had you have added to their life the short period of time that you were involved in their life. Anything else on these masculines' energy? Contract. See, they're thinking about the contract with the divine feminine. So some of them may even thinking of committing to the feminine the next time they see them. Bringing in this commitment. Sealing the deal. Making it known that they want to continue to be in a relationship with you in the future. But well, they're definitely thinking about you. They're not looking at things how they used to see it before. They now have a change of view. They're changing their point of view on this situation. See again the number six on this contract, this path of And I have attachment. So, as you can see, some of these masculines are taking off the mask. They're taking off their mask. And everything that has held them back, they're going to release that. They're going to release all those att attachments. Because that's a number five, a change. They're changing themselves. They're, they're, changing, they're changing their location. They're just changing everything around them to make sure that everything is balanced because here we have the balance card, the angel of balance. So we have this attachment in the middle of two balance cards. It definitely signifies that balance is going to be on the way. Oh my gosh, look at the bottom of the deck. I love when this card comes out, you know. And when I see my black and white, you know, I got to say it's my yin yang twin flame card, baby. <laughs> so definitely these masculines are going to be taking action. They haven't stopped thinking about taking action towards you. That's all they want to do. They don't know how they're going to do it. They're thinking about how to do it, but they're definitely going to do it. Now let's see if we can get some more, go deeper. 
with each of these feelings that these masculines are having. Tell me more about this adjacent possibilities and how you're feeling. Oh my lord. <laughs> they have a lot to say about that. Okay. We have the three of air, which is the three of swords. But this card is not talking about Heart, heartache they are seeing what had happened before just reminiscing about what had happened wondering if they will ever get out of this feeling or if they will ever forgive themselves for hurting you And now they're going to attach themselves to you and release the attachment that they had before in the past. Then we have the six of water, which is the six of cups. And the six of cups is talking about reminiscing about the past life, past relationships, holding on to that relationship thinking about the possibilities, what they have missed, how precious this relationship is to them, was to them. They're yearning for this relationship. They're yearning for their feminines. Then we have the tower. All that had happened in the past has now set the pace for something new, something more beautiful. All it, their walls have been torn down and everything that happened in their life have taught them something, something that they will use to build a new and better life with you. And I love how these cards are all blue and green. Communication and the heart chakra. Then we have the magician. They're definitely going to put everything that they have learned, every disaster, every happiness, every smile, they're going to use that to their advantage and make sure that everything is balanced with you and them. Making sure that nobody comes between you two again. Making sure that they express themselves the way they want to. So you know how they feel. More heart chakra. I love the greens. And here we have the ace of fire, which is the ace of wands, which is talking about a new beginning. So they definitely, they are definitely looking forward to a new beginning with you. That's all they're looking forward to, a new beginning and how to do it, how to start this new beginning with you. Tell me more about this fourth chakra, how you're feeling. Why is this fourth chakra card here? Three of cups celebration and more green their heart is opening up they're just thinking about I don't it's like they cannot express themselves as to how they feel when they're around you you make them so happy they know how precious you are to them they can feel it they dream about you, they think about you, they talk about you, but that's because now they can't help themselves, they can't help themselves. And here we have the justice card, more balance, balance and truth, 
justice. They have escaped everything that was holding them back in the past. Now they have stepped forward into the light, leaving the darkness behind and only one thing on their mind, their divine feminine. Tell me about this man holding a coin, please. There you go, the fool. He's definitely going to take a leap of faith. It is time. It is time. See the little fairy or angel, whatever it is, they're blowing the trumpet. It's time. It's time for his life to have meaning. It's time for him to add value to his life. And he's going to do that by adding you to his life. For the contract card, we have the Four of Air, which is the Four of Swords. These masculines are taking a break. They are resting because they have been so overwhelmed with all the energies they have been fighting in the past. Everything that they had to clear and they feel they are now ready to move forward more blue and green i just love how these cards are blue and green communication and the heart chakra opening up so expect a lot of communication from these masculines then we have the ten of pentacles which is the ten of air ten ten of earth <laughs> so they're thinking about more balance more prosperity protection abundance they just want to fill your life with all these things. They know that you deserve it. They just want to make you happy. Because they love you so much. I'm sorry I couldn't, I couldn't share that with you. That's what I just heard. I'm sorry I couldn't share that with you. A masculine just says that. But they know how much you love them. I want to be by you. I want to be with you. Yep, just repeating what they're saying. <laughs> and the messenger of water. This is the page of cups. A dreamer. Knight of cups, sorry. The dreamer. Transformed. Now he's a new person. He's seeing things from a different perspective. He's going to be taking fast action towards you. Because his head and heart is now in sync. Is now in one. And he's focused on one thing. The new direction where he's going to go to his feminine. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Tell me about this attachment. The hanged man. So these masculines have been thinking for a while. Maybe how to get out of these situations that they are in. But they have now found the answer because now... Confirmation, thank you so much. Now they're going to move on and move away from these attachments. They realize that these attachments were just holding them back and they serve them no good. They're going to make the sacrifice that they needed to make in the past. They're going to be making all those sacrifices now to make sure that they have the abundance that they dream of with you. They're releasing anything that's not of value to their life. Look what showed up. The two of water, which is a two of cups. <laughs> Love coming in. 
to tell me about this balance card. Oh my gosh. A new beginning. Ace of Earth. The Ace of Pentacles. See, these masculines are just... Uh, they're just thinking and reminisce about the feminine. Nothing else to do. <laughs> they're thinking about the new opportunities that they can bring towards you. How is it that you are able to make offers to them, but yet they could not make you an offer because they were not in the position to, but now they're in the position. They can make that offer to you. They're going to rise and make that offer to you. Some are even going to do it in public. So everybody sees, everybody knows. But they're definitely going to make you that offer. New beginning. Two aces on the board. New beginning. Let's get some guidance message for you masculines and feminines. So, okay, I love these cards. Divine order, Archangel Raguel. Everything's how it needs to be right now. Look past the illusion and see underlying order and more scale, more balance. Everything is in order, nothing to worry about. And take back your power, Archangel Raziel. Use your God given power and intention to manifest blessings in your life. So, Divine Feminine, take back your power. It's not time to sit and mope around. It's time for a change. And your masculine needs, needs your help in order for them to move forward and come towards you. Anything else? Healthy lifestyle. Archangel Raphael, eat a healthful diet. Get adequate sleep and exercise regularly for optimal health. Because you have to keep everything in order. The mind, body, and soul. Yeah, I don't want to be a weak feminine. I got to work on my health. Oh, this is too many. Okay. It's just three, okay. So we have moon cycles. Notice how the moon affects your energy and manifestations and capitalize upon these cycles. So I think there's a, a new moon that's coming around. Take note of how you feel, what your energy feels like, what happens when these new moons come around, full moon, and manifest on these. And then you have sensitivity. You are extra sensitive to energies and, and, and emotions right now. Honor yourself and your feelings. Trust the feelings that you're having. Trust them. Encourage Archangel Ariel. Be courageous and stand up for your beliefs. Stand up for what you believe in. Never back down. When you give up, that's when you lose everything within yourself. All your power is gone. You lose everything. No wonder we got the card. Take back your power. This has been your readings, guys. Your reading, guys. <laughs> I hope this does help someone to gain some clarity on their journey. Thank you so much for stopping by. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Take care, guys. Love you all. Bye.